Hi, welcome back to another video from OptiScience. In this video, we're going to set up OptiScience on a Roku device. So let's go ahead and get started. In the Roku menu, you should be able to see Add Channels. Go ahead and select that. Inside the Channel Store, you'll see a Search Channels option. And here we're going to search for OptiScience. Now, on the second character, it looks like it's already showing up. So we're going ahead and add the channel. We'll go ahead and go to the channel now. And here we're going to have to add, enter in a pairing code. So open up a browser in your uh, mobile device or on your computer. I'm going to go ahead and pull up my browser as well. And type in OptiScience to go ahead and get to the site. Here we can log in. Now here we're going to need to add a new screen. And using that same pairing code you're now seeing on your Roku device, we're going to go ahead and pair this device. And see, it shows that it is paired. We'll go ahead and give it a name. And as you already may know, there are various content types that we can uh, have displayed on this new screen. Um, and I will go ahead and add in a playlist of images. So we'll have an image playlist that we already created, maintain the landscape orientation, and save. So now we can see that the device is online and already showing uh, the new content. Now for those of you that are interested in having OptiScience automatically start up uh, when you turn on the Roku device, you can go ahead and set the channel as a screensaver now. It's going to be under the settings of the Roku device. We can go ahead and show you. Under settings, under screensaver, you can change the wait time to one minute and then uh, as you browse screensavers you can then be able to select for the actual device. Go ahead and select OptiScience. And that's it. 